The Northern California police officer caught on video brandishing his weapon to a man who filmed the entire incident has been awarded temporary paid administrative leave. Assistant City Manager Don Schwartz said in a statement, the city truly believes in community-oriented policing and deeply values the relationship between law enforcement and our community. The incident portrayed on the video is not a typical interaction between our public safety officers and the public. The incident began when Ronert Park resident Don McComas says he noticed an officer in a patrol vehicle observing him while he latched his boat onto his SUV. I stood up and just watched him, McComas described. He ever so slowly pulled away, circled the court opposite my house, and then just parked facing my house. After an honest couple of minutes, I pulled out my camera and pressed record. At the start of the filming, the officer pulls into and stops in the middle of McComas's cul-de-sac and appears to call in his license plate number. The officer then proceeds to draw his cell phone and bizarrely begins to film McComas. The incident takes a serious turn when the officer removes his sidearm from his holster and begins approaching McComas menacingly. No, sir, I haven't done nothing. I've done absolutely nothing, no. Hey, seriously. Put your gun down, really? Ever 10. Start me another one. This one's really got a gun on me. No. You don't touch me. You don't touch me. I'm at that address. Start me another one. You don't touch me. Hey, man. No, you don't touch me. When I tell you to take your hand out. I've done nothing. Nope. You go away. I don't go away. I stay where I am. You can go in your house. When McComas demands to know why the officer got out of his car, the officer replies. You're taking a picture of me. I'm taking a picture of you. You take a picture and leave. Okay. I don't have to leave. Neither do I. The officer then argues he has the right to be on the sidewalk outside of the man's house. As McComas expresses, his family has been persistently harassed by Ronert Park you Police. You have your gun out because you're a police officer and you're trying to intimidate me. And this is going all over YouTube. Put it on this you. is horrible. Trust me, I will. What's, what's wrong with you? Your station is corrupt. Oh, okay. Are you some kind of a constitutionalist? No, sir. Crazy guy or something like that? Is that, your is that what you're going after? Is that where you're going? I'm, I'm Are you throwing claims that. around? And what if he I'm was a doing? constitutionalist? Someone that believes in the founding principles that the officer should have swore an oath to. Isn't every oath-abiding police officer a constitutionalist? The video is sparking outrage, with many police accountability activist groups calling out the flagrant disregard for the rule of law and common decency. Cop Block notes, This is a blatant abuse of power and a disgrace to the man, as well as to the Rohnert Park Police Department if they choose to ignore their officers' extreme methods. The mayor and the city manager of the city of Rohnert Park released a statement saying they plan to conduct an internal review to verify that appropriate protocols were followed. The Rohnert Police Department's Facebook page was evidently deleted. A cached version shows users beginning to share the McComas confrontation on the page accompanied by comments which the department may have feared would tarnish their reputation. The Free Thought Project's Matt Agarist highlights that a section of the California Penal Code regarding drawing a firearm in a threatening manner may have been violated by the officer. According to California Penal Code 417, every person who accepts in self-defense in the presence of any other person draws or exhibits any firearm, whether loaded or unloaded, in a rude, angry, or threatening manner, or who in any manner unlawfully uses a firearm in any fight or quarrel is punishable as follows. If the violation occurs in a public place and the firearm is a pistol, revolver, or other firearm capable of being concealed upon the person by imprisonment in a county jail for not less than three months and not more than one year. Are you accusing me of a crime? Are you suspecting me of a crime? If I did, I would arrest you, okay? So, go ahead and have a nice day, put it on YouTube. I don't really care. I will, sir. Okay. A city source identified the officer as Dave Rodriguez. John Bound for Infowars.com.